Hey guys, I'm Ryan Reynolds. Um, I know this seem, is a weird time. We've been on quarantine for like ever. Um, this is my room, obviously. Um, sport I did in high school, cross country, track, um, comics, and then hope poster for humanity. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm here today, I'll be doing a poem, uh, especially for people, like, in my life that I do know and people that I don't, but, like, help others and help society go on and this government and go on and just help people in general being so selfless and, like, hopeful and empathetic towards others um yeah so i made this partially this song or poem um using my own original lyrics as well as other people's quotes or um statements based off things i've seen on instagram from artists, singers, writers, psychiatrists, educators, people who've been very educated. Um, some of the quotes are unanimous as well. Some are well known, while some are not as partially maybe well known, I don't know. Um, so this is dedicated to the people I personally dedicated to um hope yeah yeah who just help benefit us all and help motivate me as well too um so nurses this is shout out to you guys nurses doctors health clinicians psychiatrists therapists grocery workers food distributors um who all work hard to keep us healthy and safe um, and help us sustain ourselves such as giving us food and water and cleaning supplies in this time Especially since it's so troublesome and somewhat chaotic, or chaotic, obviously. Um, and then shout out to people who inspire me. Um, Sean Evans, First We Feast, Yes Theory, Coconut Yoga, where I do my yoga. Um, and then my yoga instructor, Kate. Um, my friends, Ceci, Yami, Miriam, Nani, um people from my group therapy um and my therapist from my group therapy and my outside therapist um and then my psychiatrist as well um and then everyone else in the world shout out to you guys so this is my poem and it's also could be a song um so it's called you're much more than you think it and no here we go. You carry so much love in your heart. Give some to yourself, my dear. Be you. Don't fear being authenticity. Be wary if you only trying to please yourself, pre-self, or without helping be yourself. We all come this way. Don't be ashamed. How could you think you are weak when every time you break, you come back stronger than before? It's shown through you being so down to your core, shows you're so determined and so much more. That's for sure. I'm giving you what you need to see. And here you are living despite it all. You're so virtuous. Even when you fall, you bounce back, get up and go through it all. You're so strong. Some days life is all about your dreams, hopes and visions of the future. But there are some days where life is just about putting one foot in front of the other. And that's okay. Don't let your footing bother you. 
Your balance will equilibrium sounds like serenity. These words will show how to arrange your thoughts. Imperfections not, are not inadequacies. They are reminders that we're all in this together. Even through all the chaos we have or may feel doomed, giving us perspective of hope is connection that tethers us, that makes us see and seen, heard and valued, which brings us close along with willing to manage this. If you arrange the letters in depression, D-E-P-R-E-S-S-I-O-N, you'll get I pressed on. Think about it. Your current situation is not your final destination. Tough times will pass. Listen to that as a pep talk that's spelling your motivation because sit with it, 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 sit with it. Even though you want to run, even though it's heavy and difficult, even though you're not quite sure of the way through, healing happens by feeling. Let that sink in. Sit with it. Show your emotions. Show your feelings. They have so much depth and infinite meaning. While you relate it to your values, you become so admirable. The positive thinker sees the invisible, feels the intangible, and achieves the impossible. What's it, your truth? Since you're so dang incredible. Since you're so... Dang incredible. Thank you guys. Hope you enjoyed. Be helpful. Be helpful, guys. So, yeah. Hope you guys are all doing great. Be safe out there. Be you. Be beautiful. Like one of my favorite YouTubers says. Jay Kidney. Um can I say um yeah stay you guys authenticity has a lot to show and being vulnerability as well um or vulnerable uh be strong show empathy love your friends family facetime them zoom them um Zoom party them, etc. <laughs> mm, play virtual games with them. Yeah. Cherish the time with them. Uh, go out for runs, walks, bike rides. Uh, get that vitamin D. Social distance. Oh, yeah. And for Corona, um, for runners, you should be at least 30 feet apart. And for bikers, you should be even, like, farther. I've heard from people who are doing nursing school now and doctors. Um, so, yeah, bikers should be, like, 60 feet apart um, from another biker. And a runner should be, like I said, 30 feet from another runner. Um, but when you're walking, just 6 feet. Yeah, I don't know the whole why the reason behind all that distance. Just different nurses have told me. Um, so yeah, keep safe. Um, keep quarantine, even though it freaking sucks. Um, thank you for listening to the poem. Thank you for the quotes, Brene Brown, Winston Churchill. And Rebecca Ray and Ruby Cower and R.M. Drake and the other ones that are unanimous. Or if they're not unanimous, put the people's names down there in the comments. Thank you very much. Namaste. Peace, love, respect, ashe. Previous mentors always gave me that mantra. So, yeah, peace, love, respect, balance. Hope you guys do well. See ya. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. Comment below what you're doing in quarantine. 
or fun ideas to give other people stuff to be productive or spend some time doing. Thank you. I know I said that a lot already. Thank you guys again. <laughs>